I'm ready to continue this. I only just started summer, so. And let it be known that I'll be going to the casino <laughs> to earn the rest of my totems. It's going to happen. Uh, just gonna wait for it to load. There we go. Okay. Now I got the chat up, and I guess I'm good to go. Oh wait, the wikis. Can't forget about the wikis. Okay, now I'm good. Sorry if I smell, I was sweating all night in the heat. The common thing here. Okay, it is Gus's birthday. What does Gus like? Let's take a look. Diamond, snail, fish taco, oh no, escargo, orange, which we don't have, fish taco, can't do. I guess I can give him a diamond, that's fine. I'll give him a diamond, just because it's easier. Uh, I mean, what kind of wine am I making now? I kinda can't make more strawberry wine, so I guess I'll go rhubarb. making sure. Poppy honey, which is worth 3,000. How much is 532 versus 224? Oh no, this is definitely worth selling. Nearly at the end of this. I need to check uh, the Stardew Valley expanded wiki and see what fish are unique to summer. Also, I'm going to go into Carolyn's garden thingy.
Yeah, no. <laughs> that is an inconvenience. That's one of the harder ones to catch. Oh, he's here. Hap. Okay. That's very kind of you. I like this. Alright. Hey, how do you know it's hungry? This looks delicious. Oh, I don't need a gift there anymore. Abby, please. Out of the way. Okay. Hey, Nick. How's it going, dude? Let's get this finally. Oh, hi. Good morning, warrior. I'm glad you came in. I've been meaning to show you this. It's my private sunroom. Hold on, I gotta move a window real quick. Okay. So what do you think? It's very relaxing. Yes. When I step in here, I feel calm and relaxed right away. It's therapeutic. You see, this is my sanctuary, a place where I can always find peace. And it's the perfect place to drink my homegrown tea. Here, let's have a cup. Delicious. I love to come in here for a fresh cup of tea every day. It's my little ritual. Uh, let me try to explain. When I'm alone with relaxing tea, my mind is empty and free to wander. Who knows what might appear? I want to know what's in this tea. You checked off a huge thing from your list and that's to finish the dead cell, all achievements. Oh, that's cool. That must have been quite the process. I can imagine. I heard that makes sense. Life can be pretty hectic, so having a hobby like this is nice. Feel free to come here and relax anytime you want, okay? Yes! She has a smile on her face when you talk to her. Wait, she has a smile on her neck. When you, what do you mean she has a smile on her neck? Like, now? Oh. I mean, it looks like it, yeah. I think that's just meant to be the neck. Like, I, I know that it looks like a smiley face. It just picks a lot, but I don't think... I don't think that's the intent, though. That is kind of funny, because it's just one of those things you can tell someone, and then that'll probably ruin it. They'll only see that every time they see it. You could probably ruin Stardew for a bunch of people by saying that. Yeah, no, that's a pain in the ass, this one. So what what do they want? Starfruit wine, cheese, goat cheese. Ooh. I'm not sure I can pull that one off unless I have a starfruit spare. Wait, how many do I need? Ten! Oh my god. Might potentially be doable. The cheese is easy. The cheese done. I'm not gonna bother... ...with the other stuff until it's absolutely... ...like, in the bag, you know? 
10. That's gonna be a, yeah, a tricky thing to pull off. Sweetie, I'm glad that the bus is back in service. It was trying to get lonely out here. I almost went out of business. Hey. But now you're here to buy a whole bunch of seeds, right, sweetie? Okay. Oh, it's a bad luck day. But how much does luck influence this, really? Yes! Time to gamble! So, you know, on my lucky day, I spent, what, like an hour and a bit trying to get a roll? Unlucky day, third attempt. Just, yep, just take it, dude, just take it. Oh, I can buy another one. Well... I mean, I guess... I can't believe that happened. It was immediately, it was almost the big jackpot. So, you know, luck doesn't really have correlation to this machine. gonna get me out again.
I can't believe you can buy another one of those things. I thought it was just one. Maybe it's just one per day. Which, I guess you could just save the money and just keep getting them, and then you can just fill a room with them. That'd be kind of dumb. <laughs> but, I, I guess. Like, if you had enough patience, you could do that. It'd be cool if the the jackpot were to actually give you a star drop the first time. That'd be kind of neat. But then I guess that would have been encouraging the gambling. Yeah, uh, that's something. Not what I'm after. Ah, oh, <laughs> damn it. be here a little bit. I'm putting a time box on it. I don't plan to be here more than half an hour. Hello, stylish harmonica. How's it going? Going all right. Good to hear. How's how's the last few days been? <laughs> I don't know. I can't assume everyone's doing Christmas. Uh. 
pretty good just celebrating Christmas and I. It's just I had to work yesterday. Ah, oh, that's fair enough. Your Christmas friends are waiting to be over and it's killing you. Ha! <laughs> ha, huh, yeah, I can imagine. I used to be like that until my dad starting, started messing with me. And then that kind of removed the, removed the curiosity. There was... There was one year in particular where, uh... He put this present in the middle of the pile, of, like, and it had my name on it. And it was a pretty big box. You know, I used to grab the presents and, I guess, pick them up, see how heavy they were. Maybe try to get a sound out of them. Because as a kid, you can figure out, oh, yeah, these are clothes. That sort of thing. So I go to pick up this box and I can't lift it. The thing is heavy. I get my brother to help. No, it's, it's just, it is super, super heavy. And it's the largest present there. So, you know, I'm I'm in agony for basically the whole month of December. Because I'm like, man, what what is this thing? Because it's not like a bike or something. It's... Could not figure it out. So anyway, Christmas Day comes. You know, we open our presents at midnight. Right? That's how we do things on the 24th. So what, the moment the clock strikes midnight... And it becomes the 25th, presents are open. I gotta open this giant box. And it's a box that had... Like... I think eight or so bricks. And then sandwiched in the middle is a tiny box. And then the tiny box had had like a, a pocket watch. <laughs> and that, that was the present. I mean, it was a cool pocket watch. I'm not trying to make it sound like I was ungrateful for the pocket watch. However, my dad was kind of like, yeah, see? You don't need to be curious. I'll do this to you every year if, if you keep, like, trying to find out what you got for Christmas. Because now after that point, I kind of figured, well, there's no point in me trying to figure it out. <laughs> it's... I was, it's like, there's a difference, but there was a difference between being curious, which is fine, but I was like a little annoying about it. I can admit as a kid, I was probably a little bit annoying about it. And so that was his way to just be funny. And so, you know, I guess I, I tell her this story because... Agonizing over having to open them. Yeah, but it could be worse. You could have like a box of bricks. Thinking it's something else. Just give me one big jackpot and then I can be out of here.
Uh, my growing live notification said I was going to be here, so. I do not disappoint. It's just not working. I mean, I've gotten bigger jackpots today than than yesterday when supposedly it was a good luck day when I was here. And today's a bad luck day, so it plays no part in how this works. I wish I could control the jackpot. I'm gonna be at this casino for like another 15 minutes, and that's the, the time window I have given it, so... Either way. Okay, yeah, I mean, but it's like, it's not, it's not a big jackpot. Like, any one of the bottom three, and then I'll have the money I need to do what I want to do. I have to point it out again, it's, it's like, I don't gamble in real life, never have, probably never will. It's, it just doesn't interest me, but when it comes to like, gaining some sort of advantage in a game, I will hit my head against this brick wall. <laughs> All right. There it is. Now... Just out of curiosity, how much is this worth? It's worth 10. Okay, it's not worth much at all. I'm gonna get one of these. So now I have another one. Okay, stop. Cool, so I have over 500 War Poem Totems now. So now... The rest of this playthrough, whenever I want to go home, and I want to save time, I can just do it. That's it. Easy. Worth it. It's almost like having the wand. Except the wand takes you to your doorstep and this doesn't, but... 
Close enough. You didn't open that all yet, so you're technically spoilering us off. Oh. Well, you know, I... Uh, the game's, I don't know how many years old now, so... Yeah, that's fine. We all make choices. Besides, it's not that big of a spoiler. Yeah, I could teach you something. Yeah, I mean... Basically, if you get the casino, keep gambling and then you can end up with... Enough farm totems to just do whatever you want. It just makes it easier. That's just one thing I always do. Oh yeah, this hat is kind of a moot point now. Where'd I get the hat? Where did I get the hat? I think I got it from the mouse, so I'm pretty sure you just go to him and he has it. Like, 90% sure. You might need to do something to unlock it, but that's where I, I got it from. The, you know the, the little mouse, um... He's like, he's got a little house here. Mouse, pretty sure. 90% sure. See, if I could be bothered, I would have started re-answering the question and then gotten up halfway. And you would have heard my voice going, sorry, I walked away. But I, I, I can't be bothered. I'll probably come back here tomorrow because I want I want to see this this totem thing. It's new, by the way. It's like in modded, so it's not like it's in vanilla. But like, if they sell it every day, that's kind of dumb. Because then I'll just win. I'll just win myself another jackpot and then just keep buying them because they just give you these. And in each of these, there's a chance that you get a five thousand gold treasure chest in there. I also need to do the artifacts for the museum, so it kind of doubles up as that, but like... If I win one jackpot, I can buy ten of them and then just put them, like, in storage. I don't know. I like the stuff the mod adds, but some of it, admittedly, I think is a bit too strong. Alright, I'll put my hat back on just so I have an extra slot. Oh yeah, the slimes don't attack me anymore. I forgot about that. <laughs> yeah. They're not a threat at all. I can just... But I can still hurt them. Oh, look. <sighs> I 
Okay, put this away. I made you on a play. Yeah, well, uh, this is one of these games where if you watch people play, you'll want to play yourself. It's almost like a weird form of peer pressure. Don't worry too, Mona says, but I'll be on the one. Good. I better be. <laughs> nah, I'm kidding. I could never go back to one monitor. Sometimes I have to and I had to work on a laptop, but... I guess that was different because it was work, but like for everything else... I have three at the moment. But I could deal with like going back to two. The third one's kind of just a luxury. Two is, ne two is a necessity, I think. Three is a luxury. Yeah, I mean, it, it makes sense. Like, a lot of the time people are multitasking on the computer, they're doing more than one thing. Or they'd want to refer to something. There are two things that I will never part with. One is my internet connection, and the other one is... ...the monitors. Sometimes you have assignments and you'll be like, nah, make them at home just because two monitors. Yeah, I mean, it is a time saver. I used to have to do a bunch of video editing for work, I'd just be like, yeah, I'm not gonna... I'm gonna work from home today. And this was before, like, the office became fully remote. But, like... I could take my laptop to the office and do it, but then when it came to, like, spitting out the video, it would just take four times longer. Or I could stay at home, where it comes out... in so much less time. I don't know if I can be bothered selling the sword, but I guess I'll do it. You can go there. Oh, wait. Okay, so... Oh, wait, no, I need you. That is required. I have to start condensing things. Do I have Discord? I do. Pretty small server, but... It's alright. Work from home is great. It's just... There's a couple things about it. You kind of have to... Do a bunch of stuff that you wouldn't think... Like, uh... 
you have to kind of get up and go for a walk. I know that might sound weird, but like, even if you drive to work, throughout your day, you kind of get up and walk around and do stuff. Whereas if you're working from home, that kind of gets cut out of the equation. And you don't really realize that right away. So you have to do a bunch of stuff to like, uh, be... I guess healthy? I don't know. I wouldn't call it healthy, but... What am I gonna put in here? But I mean, otherwise it's great. It's just... You don't have to travel, and if you want to do stuff during the day, like laundry, or if you want to pop out for like a few minutes and get like some groceries, you can. I, it's not for everyone. Like, I know people that hate it, but I think it's better overall. Um, and you can join if you want. Where is... You know what, I'm just gonna use this. I don't even think I have enough. I think I have like at least 24. Uh, I mean, that's probably not enough. I'll do coconut. I need to get rid of this anyway to condense. Okay, go, go. Like, I was gonna sell these either way, because I have iridium-quality ones now, and I just want a single stack. Okay. That'll do. I'm gonna move those. I just need to hit the money for the house and then I'm gonna make a shed and move them in there immediately. Once I get the house upgrade, then I'll start, like, making my house look nice. Because <laughs> th this can't remain forever. Like, this is... I don't want to work today. Okay. Cool. Vegetable stew. Um, I haven't finished the bundles either. I have- I, I'm just waiting for fruit, pretty much, and then I'll get it done. It'll happen in like the next... I don't know, four days? However long it's gonna be. I could have gotten it done in the first year, but I... I messed up. I kind of forgot a, a couple things. It's all right. I mean, I tried. <laughs> Hello, Puma's friend. How's it going? Uh, it's going well here. Just kind of working through this farm. Alright, so yeah, in two days I'll get the friendship bundle done, and then in five days I'll have enough apples to get the final one done. So. That doesn't sound like a lot of time, but five days is effectively... Three, four hours. Okay. You know what? I have an idea. So I can get the money for the house. I'm just gonna do the... Because I haven't done it in a while. I'll just... Sell half my gems and then that should cover the remaining costs. I would hope.
Do you mind if you join the voice chat? Oh, it's not a voice chat. Like, that's just, uh... What do you call it? I'm listening to music through it, because Discord doesn't really allow it any other way, so, yeah. And I can't do it through stream. So no one can talk in it, not even me. Like, it's just routing my, uh, my audio through it. It's a compromise, because, yeah, we're past the days where streamers can play music. I mean, you can still do it, it's just, there's always the risk that your channel gets taken for a strike. So, you know. Looking into Stardew Valley streams, trying to learn more, just got it yesterday. Don't know the best way to start up and progress. Oh. Well, uh, I mean... I guess I should ask is like, are you new to the farming sim style? Like, have you played anything like Harvest Moon or... What's a more recent one? I always forget the name of that 3D one that people play. But I have a copy of it. I'm bad with names. Let me go through my Steam library. My time at Porsche. That's the one I'm thinking of. But yeah, I mean, if you want advice, ask around here. I'm sure people will want to answer. I can answer as well. I like the start of music. It's just the problem I have with it is that it just stops sometimes. And it stops for, like, a very long time. So that's why. So, I mean, I guess the thing I would say would be don't stress too much at the start. It's kind of, it might seem overwhelming, but as you play it, you'll kind of pick up on things. And then this is one of these games that the first time you'll play, it, you'll look back on it and be like, man, I, I didn't do that well on it. But it's a learning experience. So, I mean, you plant your crops and then the rest of it is kind of, you learn where people are so you can talk to them and make friends with them. Um, and then finding the best ways to make money. So, yeah. At the start, me personally, I don't go heavy on farming and tend to fish a lot more. But that's, yeah, me. Like, I know people that hate fishing. But I find fishing to be, like, a very good source of money. And then you can kind of buy tool upgrades and, uh... I mean, you need to go mining first, but yeah. Okay, so let me think. What am I going to do today? And, uh, if you're ever thinking... Pause, like, hit escape, pause the- this pauses the game, so you can buy yourself some time. Like, what I'm doing right now. I'm thinking about what to do. Um, I need to go water the other plants. Unfortunately in co-op, the, the game doesn't pause. <laughs> Which, <laughs> you have to learn how to think quicker, but here I can- I can stop and just relax. Uh, I guess the only other piece of advice I would say is... Until you learn... Just... I would recommend keeping one of each item. Including crops. There are some that you'll need multiple of, but generally speaking, if you keep one of each, then... You kinda have the item ready if anyone asks for it. But eventually you'll learn 
specific ones that you should keep and others that you can just sell right away. But yeah. Hope it isn't a problem putting your Discord thing. Nah, I mean, if you want to connect with people on the stream, go for it. I mean, what? How dare you be social? Using the wiki is always a great way to learn as well. Yeah. The wiki is definitely something you should have handy. There's also YouTube. I'm sure there's videos out there that, like, try to run you through your first day. Also, hey, Kat. Why is this area still so ugly? Because I want to put fruit trees here eventually, Kat. I don't have the money for the fruit trees. So once I get the house upgrade, then I'll focus on making things looking nice. I want to put fruit trees there and maybe like a bench or something, make it like a park. And then I have like a secondary source of fruit. Cat says this because... Like, I, I can make things look nice, it's just a lot of the time I won't. Not until very later. So, yeah. I'll just do a split and sell... Like... It's probably good enough. Where did I put... I think it's in here. No. Put you in here. There it is. Okay, uh, let's take some Omni Geodes. It's probably enough. I gotta take a flower. That's enough. And we're going back to the desert. But yeah, I decided on a park with fruit trees because then I can turn it into something that's like no maintenance and. If I don't go there, it doesn't feel horrible. Like, I could go there once every three days. I just don't like having something so far away from my main farm to have to worry about. So I think that's a good compromise. It offers utility. And I still get a decent use out of it. And hey, if I can get, like, outdoor stuff to put there and turn it into a park, it'll look good. I'm not going to gamble. I'm just kind of curious here. Oh, so you can get one of these every day. Then that that is kind of dumb. <laughs> Cuz let's say I, I win a, a big jackpot. And I'm picking one of these up every day. Then effectively like I get a, a potential source of, like, strong income. I did say I was going to be doing the casino stuff today, so... I'll just earn enough so I have, like, a couple thousand once I buy the totem thing. I won't be here forever. It's just if I buy it now, I'm going to be out of coin. So I want to have like a buffer. I think, if I think back on my first playthrough, I think the thing I regretted the most, and I had to, and I, d I definitely restarted my file, 
was in spring when the festivals came up and there was stuff you could buy from it. The first one didn't seem so bad, but then... It was because it was just the egg hunt, but then... The second one that happens, I was like, I was kind of not happy about it because that was a lot of extra money that I could have made had I known about it. And it was a crop as well, like, I didn't have any money on the day and they were selling seeds. And I wish I would have known that up front. Because I would have saved money. And you know, once the day is there, there's nothing you can do about it, it's just... That's it. At the time, I guess I didn't consider looking at the wiki because I was I didn't have internet access. I was like ugh, just on my phone. That's all I had at the time when I was playing this for the first time. So that was not great. And then I guess the other thing was, um, when your farm does get raided, I got a bad rating. <laughs> well, not bad, but not, you know, the best, so. I was like, no, I can 100% do better. So, yeah. And I found out, like, how the farm gets raided. It's based on a bunch of different things, so just making sure that... Okay, there we go. Making sure that all that stuff was taken care of before the farm gets raided. I am, uh, I gotta take the Santa hat off. <laughs> I'm still carrying it. Uh, hold on. Okay. <laughs> that was a lot of flaws, very quickly. Uh, I suppose it is like a... A lucky day, I guess. Again? Okay, hang on. At this rate, uh, I'm catching up, like... I'm kind of at the point that you should be if you're going for floor 100, roughly. Oh. Not anymore. Get 
crit. Dinosaur, I think. Yeah. I'm not sure what you get for this. I think it's just uh, cosmetic. No, it's okay, the slimes won't hurt me. It's so much easier. Okay. Uh, hold on. I guess this is worth the least. Oh wait, I don't have the... I don't have the ring that causes explosions. Just don't worry about that. That there you go. I didn't see the can before. Ah, go away. Remember to bring my ruby here to trade it for food again. Oh. Okay. 
I'm gonna let this play out. I could maybe make it to a hundred. And this is like coming here halfway through the day, that's pretty good. And not using bombs. Oh wow. Okay, hold on. I have to do this. Jackpot! No! I need to make room. Uh, look. That's probably the one worth the least. I'm gonna trust the one that was already here. Ah. I mean, for coming here like halfway through the day, damn. Pretty decent. If I were to come here from the morning, like, I'd easily go past 100. Okay. And it's time to go by. There we go. <laughs> I think I have enough for the house. Yeah. All right, cool. Finally. Uh, Mario's birthday, that's easy. The Luau. Okay, I know what to take for this Luau. You just put in a butterfish. Well, for the mod, that is. Okay, one thing I'm going to do right away, and it's pretty much just, give me a sec, take, bring these, uh, and these, I'm just going to go to the desert and trade these right away, because I didn't get a chance to yesterday. Go. This upgrade's just a hundred thousand gold, right? Like, it's not... It doesn't have any materials involved. Like, you just need the money. Oh. 
that's not what I was clicking. They're not done yet. Ugh. Okay, uh, let's see, tech feather for bee chip stuff. Do I need to keep giving George stuff? Yes. Okay, so... Lois, I'm pretty sure, is done. A lick for George, catfish for Willy. Um... omni Jed for the dwarf. Butterfish for Andy. Uh, Peppa for Shane, potentially. Just take these, just in case. Uh, what am I missing? Krobus is one. Where do I put my horseradish? There. Horseradish for Krobus. Uh, any kind of gem. This will take two of these. Cola for Sam. Solar Essence for the Wizard. Wood for Robin. Okay. <laughs> I have something for everyone. Pam, what are you? Okay, Pam needs friendship, so... Hold on. You get this. Oh, Grape for the kid. I forgot Harvey's coffee. Yeah, I did. <sighs> Alright. Uh, look, you can have that. I also forgot... <laughs> Maru's present. I'll do a couple laps. He's not in here. Fish for Willy. Some fish come and go with the seasons, others only come out at night or in the rain. Okay, where is Elliot hanging out? Apparently he's this way. I might stop by home if I'm going this way. Wait. I 
Okay, this map is like completely non-representative. <laughs> um, Andy, there you go. Blasted bees stung me today. Next time I need to put on gloves when harvesting that honey. I haven't seen this cutscene yet, so... I'm never in here. Hey, hi, warrior. Come in. I'm just working on the sculpture here. Come here, watch this. See that? I'm revealing the essence of wood. Once you get past the outer layers, the true nature starts to show. Sure. What? Oh yeah, that's absolutely right. I first visited this valley as a little girl when on vacation with my parents. I knew I had to come back someday. This place has great artistic potential. Although I have to admit, it's not easy to pay the bills as an artist. Why don't you have an art show? Hmm. Interesting. I guess that could set the wheels in motion to making Pelican Town a true art destination. But what if no one likes my sculptures? I'd be crushed. I'll have to think about it. Well, thanks for stopping by, warrior. Hold on. Oh, cutscene two. Kel, how many times do I have to tell you? I don't want to move back to the city or come to the city, sorry. Stop calling me. I don't want to hear from you anymore. Warrior. So I guess you heard me yelling on the phone. That was my ex. I guess I'd better tell you a little about it. We had an apartment together back in the city. I did odd jobs during the day and spent all night working on art projects. We barely made enough to scrape by. He was always nagging me to go back to school or study business or medicine. Something with a lot of money in it. I guess the idea was to save up for a normal life, you know? A house in the suburbs, kids, PTA meetings, that sort of thing. I wasn't ready for that kind of life, Warrior. I had to leave. So I came here to pursue my dream of being an artist. Was that selfish of me? No, it had to be done. No, you're right. I just wouldn't have been happy back there. It was better for both of us to end an unsustainable relationship while we were still young and flexible. Anyway, I've been thinking a little more about that archer you had in mind. I'm working on some new sculptures to display at the show. I'm nervous, but the thought of getting my work out there is pretty exciting. I'm just glad you're on board with making Stardew Valley a premier art destination, Warrior. Okay, now can I please go and- Oh! <laughs> Three cutscenes. <laughs> I think this is a new one. Oh wait, no, 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 it's not a cutscene. They're just hanging out. I thought it was gonna start a cutscene. Damn it. Uh, beach hipster. Present. Uh, what do I have for her? Grape? Okay, good. <laughs> Cause the speech bubble appeared. I thought it was a cutscene. Ugh. It's fine. Okay, I'm coming back for Maru's present. They almost got me. Okay, one sec. First things first. Easy. Uh, 
That's 10,000 gold. Okay, uh, and give Clint this. Who's seen as this? Oh, it's this kid. Oh, Warrior, I didn't see you there. I was just checking out, um... What should I say? Uh, what are you reading? That's, uh... I'm doing some research, it's... Okay, I guess I'll level with you, Warrior. I say we're friends now, right? See, this book here? It's a book of genealogy. There's a lot of old families in the valley. Bet you didn't know this, but Pelican Town has some of the best records of families in the area of any library around. I guess it's kind of a weird hobby for a guy my age to have, huh? Not that weird. Expanded more? Yeah, checking it out for the first time with some other things. I mean, definitely a little weird, but I've got a good reason. I'm adopted, it's not a big deal, but I don't know who my birth parents are, and sometimes I come in here just to poke around, thinking I might learn something. I love my parents, but I've never felt like I belonged in our family, even before they told me. Anyway, I come here to look around, that's all, and it's a good excuse to get out of the house. I feel more at home in Pelican Town than I do in the country, even if it weren't for the books. I met you here, and, and Claire too. Thanks for listening, and for making me heal, feel at home here. I'll get back to reading now. What are, what are they doing over here? I just <laughs> noticed that. Okay. I'm fluent in different languages, including Dwarvish. One must understand different languages to unravel the secrets of the past. Uh, let me just... What is Gunther like? Bean Hot Pot likes perfect slime. Okay. Likes Elvish. He likes the rare disc. I have that. Alright, excellent. Or loves, I should say. Dwarvish stuff, the ancient sword. Okay. I'll keep that in mind. I don't have anything to donate, so... Then... Likes the ancient sword, give them that. And then I have the others that I'm gonna keep. Okay, uh, you... Guess that's it for now here. Alright. Uh wait, where's George? Oh, he's at his house, it's just the map is off. Present. Okay, that's it. George is done. Alright, and Maru is back at her house. I'm not gonna lie, Gunther in normal Stardew feels like a really empty NPC with only one purpose. Yeah, I always did find, find it strange that he just never turned up to the events and yet I think Marlin, whilst not at all of them, I think he was there for a couple. It was really weird.
I do like that they've given some of these lesser used NPCs more purpose. Okay, hopefully there's enough to do Pierre's vegetable thing here. I planted a hundred, so you would think that at least I'll get 20 out of it. In full ancient seed farmland. It's in the greenhouse. I got an ancient seed on day nine, so I have quite a few of them already. They're just in the greenhouse at the moment. Sam, um, yeah. Cool. I forgot what you like. What do you like? Cakes, pretty much. She also likes hardwood. Since I have it here. There you go. So she's like Robin, but she also likes cake. Okay, hang on. I'm gonna go visit Maru now. First, the dwarf. Okay. I'm not reading the dwarf. <laughs> he just has the same lines over and over again. Okay, Marlin. I guess we'll just give you this. I'll find some use for this. The valley has come a long way since I first came here. I miss the early days a little. Most of the changes are good. Oh. I guess that was the new reward. Can I wear it? I can. <laughs> I mean, it's not Christmas anymore, so... This... Also, it's not something Warrior would ever wear. Wait, what? There we go. It's fine. Please tell me she's still here. She moved, didn't she? No, she's there. <laughs> okay. Present. Hello, Favago. How's it going? Oh, right. I forgot you. I forgot to get your present of tears. Uh, wait, where is she? Oh, there she is. Okay, there you go. And that's Maru done. Right, because I think she doesn't go beyond that. Yep. Okay, I mean, I'm getting there. Uh, where is Shane? At the bar, okay. Wouldn't it be fun if you can't eat while wearing it? 
It would be amusing. But then you'd, there'd be a bunch of other things, I'm sure, that, like, would have to stop working for the sake of realism. There you go. Every day is the same. Stocking horrible shells, going to the saloon, tossing and turning all night. Okay, but friendship is maximized with you. What about you? That's done. Okay, Gus, present. Gus went up a level. I suppose it's kind of hard to make shopkeeper NPCs have too much of a life, now that I think about it. I mean, I think in Gunther's case, the solution would be just have, like, some sort of machine you can place the thing into and donate to it instead. Or, like, a drop-off box. Like, maybe when he's not there, you can put it in a box. I don't know. Animal Crossing has that. It's after hours for the shop. You put it in a box. Uh, I mean, these were just purely just so I got them. I mean, you want to talk about reality? Let's talk about the reality of Lewis asking someone to go get his pants after... He's quite clearly hooked up. Let's talk about reality and whether whether or not someone would do that for real. If we want to pick one thing <laughs> to, like, scrutinize. Okay, I'm putting away the hat. I don't need the hat anymore. Go back to just regular warrior. Some random realism is funny, like Minecraft trolling newbies. How's that realism, though? <laughs> Having, like, what do you mean? Like, what? What would be trolling a new player that would be realistic? I guess like the sand and gravel like any other block, but I mean that's- I, I still think that's within the realm of fantasy. I think a good way to introduce realism would be, like, if you try to, I don't know, let's say punch a block to mine it, and then your hand just hurt, and did nothing. Okay. Oh, I forgot to go, oh, I forgot to go buy the house. Okay, tomorrow, first thing, first thing. First thing. The moment it's open, I'm going there. I knew I forgot something. I was too busy making friends. I knew it. <laughs> oh, I can't do it today because it's the luau. I can't do it today either. <laughs> but I guess today is going to be a short day, so fine. I guess it doesn't matter too much. Unless she's still open. She might still be open. I'm gonna go check, but... She might not be. Like, for whatever reason, they just close up on these mini holidays.
Okay, these are ah. Okay, we go pomegranate. Now I just gotta wait. I'm gonna take all of them now, but like, just gotta wait for the apple. Oh, I don't have space. But yes, I do. What? <laughs> I didn't. There we go. I need two more apples. Uh, what else am I going to plant in here? Oh yeah, and I need to save, like, the gold standard ones. I'm going to put them in here uh, for now. No, wait, no, I'm not. Okay, hold on. I will now. Is that all the fruit? I mean, coffee, like, yeah. Okay, there we go. Now it's split. Ah, <sighs> alright. What seeds have I got? Alright, just do another batch of them. That's going to be my lure thing. I think I have three minutes to get there from memory. Uh, I, I mean, I guess I'll carry it. If I run into Elliot, I can just gift him it right away. Alright, I'm gonna go visit Robin and hopefully... Wait, why is she here? Good morning, Wario. I just finished my morning jog. I got a good look at your farm. The progress you've made is amazing. I see that the buildings I constructed for you are still holding up. Hope they're serving you well. <laughs> Did a great job. That's great to hear. I wasn't here in the valley yet when your grandpa was working the farm. I think Sebastian was maybe around two or three years old when your grandpa retired. It's still incredible how beautiful the farmland is now. I remember reading about it when it was mentioned in the news. That was a while ago. I hope you get another interview, Wario. You've made a lot of progress since then. I'm going to go home and shower. I'll drop by later if you need anything. Yeah, how about a house? I would- I would like an extension to my house, please. 
Postpone that shower. You need to get to work right away. Nah. Yeah, then they'll never open. So... Alright, let's just go there. Do I have the problem? I don't have the pomegranate on me. That's fine. I can always do it after the luau. There's still time. Excuse me. Okay, since this is the second time we've done this, I'm just gonna quickly talk to everyone. Not really read it because they say the same thing every time. So I did all the reading in year one. Although, actually, oh, you know what? There is one person that I should read because he wasn't here in year one, but other than that. Okay, I will read Kent. Hey, good to see you. Great contribution. Worth the time. All right. There's the butterfish. Uh... Okay, there's nothing here I want. I don't get why the bridge gets this... <laughs> gets destroyed again. I feel like that's a mild oversight. Just for this luau every year, they just destroy the bridge. Oh wait, yeah, you. Slow roast ham. That's all he said. I think that's it. Uh, hold on. Pretty sure that's it. Okay. Yep, we put nothing but the highest ingredients in here. Highest quality. I can't say I've ever been to something like this where they make a soup out of whatever ingredient everyone brings. Can't say I've ever done that. Okay. Uh, I mean, I gotta put jelly on, but at the same time, I gotta take this. What do I even put on? I guess I might have enough with this. Coconut jelly is actually very legit, though. Wait, I missed one, I missed one, I saw, I saw. Oh, right. It left my horse back at the beach.
Wait a minute. Yeah, no, it's fine. Right? Yes, Enchanter's Bundle. Right, okay. <laughs> and then this is just three apples, right? And that's it. So the two days and it'll it'll get done. Oh yeah, what am I doing? Why am I walking home like a sucker? I have this. 523 typos. I should be using them more. I need to get out of that habit of walking. Okay, but the house is ready, so that's gonna go into the cellar, all those cheese. And I guess I should try and get more hardwood so then I can just fill up with casks. Well, keep that around, I mean. As long as I have to give stuff to Elliot, I should keep the feathers. Okay. I may have just seen some duplication here. Okay, these can go. These can go. I don't know. I think these these little things are a bit a bit overpowered, especially because they don't cost that much. You can get one every day from the casino. Crispy bass from Kent, pumpkin soup from Robin, stuffing, lost lobster bisque. All right. Okay, now <laughs> let me finally go get this house sorted. Pending another disaster. I should be able to get it today. Wait, Poppy is worth more than Sunflower? I guess it is. Then I should probably keep it for Mead. If it's not worth... If it's not the most expensive one. It's more, it's worth more than Tulip, but it's fine. Oh, I have hops now too.
I feel like I'll be able to put chilies in here as well soon. I should probably do that now, to be honest. Oh, Mrs. Seuss. Thank you for the follow. Appreciate it. Oh, you know what? I'll wait. I'll just grab the two tomorrow. Okay. Animals, go to Robin's, purchase the house. <laughs> then I'll worry about the rest of the day. I wonder if there's a mod that makes them have their shops open during festival days. There are some that are understandable where they'd be closed, but then there's one where it's like, oh, the kids are having a dance, let's close shop for the day. Beach barbecue? Yes. Give up a whole day's income for that. <laughs> I'm sounding more like Wario, just like, eh, what would you give up money for that, eh? Okay, well... I guess I, now that this is done, I should move towards Iridium Tools. I'm trying to think, like, what else you would use money for at this point. Hi, Wario, come in. I, I know I want to make a, sh a second shed, but... That can't happen while she's building the house, so I've got some time. I've been working on a new project, something big. This is just one component. Let me show you a little demonstration. Just put your hand in here. Or here. Now, I'm going to flip the switch. Oh, no! Oh my god, are you alright? Here, let me apply this burn cream. Magical burn cream. I'm so sorry. Uh, it's okay, it doesn't even hurt. Oh no? Well, that makes me feel a little better then, thanks. That kind of ruined the moment, huh? <sighs> Okay. Yeah! <laughs> Finally. 100,000 gold gone. Oh, you know what? I forgot. Alright, I'm gonna get an Iridium Axe. Those signs are an inconvenience, but if I don't put them there, the cat will... Just sit in that spot and we'll be in the way anyway. <laughs> so. Ok, 
Okay, first things first. Nice. Okay. There's something I can go in the museum. Uh, upgrade tools, Iridium X. Alright, sweet. Um, just hold on a sec. Okay. Have the ruby. <laughs> oh, there's a crystallarium in here. Okay, well, hold on. Uh, I mean, I should I should organize this now. This might take a minute, but I think there's enough here for me to organize it again. So, let's see. I need to put this on orange. Why is this so annoying? Okay. Alright, move the green ones over here temporarily. I wish you could just click swap, that would be so useful. If I'm talking about a smooth color, probably go this way. Oh, this is gonna take forever. <laughs> Moving these up here. Oh, um, I forgot the relic. But I guess I, I guess it's. Uh, I forgot about the relic. <laughs> I haven't forgotten about another, have I? No. I wish you could just do this, but ugh. Okay, move it to the side here. There we go. Okay, now. There's still more to do. Right. I've missed one. Uh. 
かは Okay. What am I missing? Is this right? I think I think I'm okay now. Sure. The fossils are together, I think. I mean, uh, there's like stuff I could do to make this better. I think for now, in the interest of not driving people insane. <laughs> but I mean, this looks visually satisfying, I think. It's just, there's more I can do to it, but for now. For now, that's fine. Oh, I forgot to check on the plants. Whoops, it's okay, I can go back quickly. Sophia, please. I love you, but like... <laughs> it's my own fault. Like, I, I need to make the house look good, and I will. Just the moment the extension's gone, all of this is gonna... I'll make it look nice, I promise. And then I need to move stuff around. Ugh, okay. Um, I forgot to put the truffle on. Okay. I need to check on the crops real quick. I'm, I don't know if they're... Done, they might be. Okay, they're done. Uh, I need wait, not that. Okay, twenty five in total. I heard a ding, but that's because it's at 16. Once I have the money, I will turn this into a park. Just not yet. Okay, I have enough. I suppose I could fix it so that the tiles don't look bad, but I don't know, putting effort into something that's going to change later anyway. There are things that are far more messy looking. Hot Pepper Susan, yes. I'm going to do that today. Okay, that's done. 2,500. 
One of them sells for 3,500. That is... <laughs> that is not worth it. But I guess I think you get something else for it as well, but... Just... Yeah, maybe I should have done a cheaper crop. It's fine. We should have just gotten them... Like, string beans or something. Okay. Um, this will go in here for pickling. Alright. And... Because I want to hurry up. Oh wait, it's in this thing. I think quality does matter. I didn't even check she's home. Okay, she's here. There you go. Okay. I just, I, I want to illustrate just how broken this is. Okay, I have 9,050 gold, so let's just try and make up the rest of this. I think they need to change this. I think that statue thing. If they're gonna make it constantly available, maybe once a week, or maybe once a month. I should- or season, I should say, but like, every day being able to get one of these things, I don't know. If you're like me and like to, I guess, kinda break things, you could come here every day, get the jackpot, be patient, and then get one of those every day. Like, okay, there we go. And just get another one. Like, I almost have enough for it already. It shouldn't take more than five minutes. And then that thing is giving you treasure troves, which... They can give you items that are worth five grand. It just seems like... It seems a bit strong. Damn it. <laughs> Almost got excited. Ah, come on. That would have been great. I'm not going to be here very long. Like, if it, if it doesn't give me it in the next five minutes, I will stop. <laughs> I don't want this to turn into a whole thing. I'd honestly be happy with anything below parsnip, because that would let me afford another one. Okay. 
Doesn't matter which one, just any. Oh, hold on, my headphones are almost flat. I just need to swap the battery. I can keep talking. I just, you might hear noises. <laughs> It's just any, and I'm, I don't even care about the big ones. Just any one of these little ones is fine. This is just my luck. Like, anytime I'm actively looking for something, it just takes me forever. But then, when I'm not looking for it, it happens immediately. I did say five minutes, so that window's nearly up. Okay, ten more rolls. So ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three, two, one. Not gonna get it. Zero. Alright, I mean, yeah, I'm up, but like, let's not turn this into a whole thing. I'll spread it out over a few days. Okay, I'll spend the rest of the time in the mines. If I wasn't streaming, I, I would 100% sit there. <laughs> Until I won, like, several jackpots. And then I would come here every day. To pick up one of those statues, just... To show how dumb they are. But I'm not going to do that. It's fine.
Hey, tomorrow the bundles are gonna be done, so that's it's a big deal. I'm pretty sure I already have, with the exception of the aged wine, I think I have everything for the final bundle. Pretty sure. Slime. Oh, yes. Wario loves birthday cake. Especially when it's pink. Just like his pants. for it. so happy that this house upgrade's coming in, because now I can start working on the next phase of upgrades. I think I need wood more than stone right now, so... Unfortunately, my axe is being worked on, but I think after that I'm gonna do a bit of a focus on wood.
I got a little bit of time before I, I have to leave. Like another 40 seconds. Ish. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> I have quite a bit of stone. I think I definitely have to take the time to get more, uh, more wood. Because I think, by comparison, wood is like... It's, it's not horrible, but it's nowhere near to the level that my stone is. All right, let's do this. Bumbles will end today. Oh, it's another day of rain. Sweet. It's uh, his birthday. I forget what he likes. Okay, that would have been funny if those signs were in Robin's way and she would have destroyed them. Because that's what NPCs do when stuff is in their way. They just destroy it. It's okay, that wasn't the case. So I'm gonna wait to harvest that one. I want those two to be aligned. I'll take the hit. I'm just gonna make some seeds out of this, I think. Oh, I already have 31. Well, that's easy. Still. I'm going to start putting tea in here as well. Okay, I'll color these. Red for fruit, green for veggie. I'm missing a peach. Why am I missing a peach? Hmm. Interesting. Why am I missing a peach? Oh, 
Oh, no, I see why. Because this one came in later. Yep, yep, yep. It came in a day later. That's why. Because I didn't buy them all at the same time. I didn't have enough money for the peach tree at the end because it's the most expensive one. Okay. It is fine. This is going to be good because a bunch of friendships are just going to reach their maximum level now because of this. <sighs> okay. I might check the fishing for uh, the mod and see if there's any fish that are exclusive to the mod in summer. Since it's raining, it's probably the best day to do it. Okay, so whilst this isn't, you know, a one-year thing, it's not bad. The last bundle. Farewell, warrior. Farewell. Goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> oh, yes. All right, it's done. Oh, I forgot to check what Alex likes. Okay, hold on. Alex likes complete breakfast, which I, I do have one of, or a salmon dinner. I'm pretty sure I have one. Complete breakfast. I have one. Okay, hang on. Put that here. Do we have a tulip for it? Oh, hold on. It just kind of changes things a little, I think. Maybe. Maybe it goes through tomorrow. There you go. Mmm, I smell barbecue. <laughs> Damn, I could go for a burger. I don't think anyone's barbecuing today. Okay, uh, let's just... I'm gonna check the expanded wiki for fish. Specifically summer. Okay, bull trout we got. Okay, far so far so far so good. Um, it looks like there's quite a bit. Okay, we got minnow. Got that razor trout in town. Oh no, but that's specific to um, Georgia. Okay. 
Okay, it doesn't look like there's... There's anything I need to get right now. So there's no fish I need to get. Uh, how's Sandy going? Okay, I've already given her two presents. I can't cut wood. So... I guess that just leaves here. Tomorrow I'll get my axe back. I'll talk to her still though. <sighs> Alright. Ten minutes. That's the most I can spend here. Ten minutes. I'm, bud I'm giving myself a budget. I'm looking at the clock now. It's until... Like, I can afford a totem, or, uh, ten minutes, whichever comes first. I think that is an excellent way to manage this. Alright, that's it. Uh, I got a jackpot. That's that's the requisite. Prerequisite. Done. I bought my statue for the day. Alright, that's it. That was painless. It is a good luck day, so I want to be in the mines. I think I need to go to the beach and start collecting coral as well for the totems. It's the one thing I haven't done much of yet. Why did I do that? Ah, yes, the torch. I'm gonna... Yeah, bye. I don't know why I did that. So good to not have to worry about slimes anymore.
Uh, I'm gonna go check the end real quick. Ah, uh, empty. Okay, I get it. For a lucky day, this show doesn't feel lucky. <laughs> Having to smack practically every rock in a room. And no coal either. Dinosaurs. Uh, get rid of that. No coal. Why are you no magnet? There we go. It's gonna happen. Like, watch. Okay, that's fine. Yep, there it is. <laughs> There's a reason. Ah, uh, mushroom. I can get that anytime at home. Oh, sap. There we go. I'm gonna run out of room again. It's gonna happen again. Yeah. 
getting the gold. There's another one up there. Well, since it gave me one, may as well. Even the shaft. Of uh, what? This is supposed to be a lucky day. What is going on? <laughs> Where is my coal? Where are the shafts that go further than four floors? Where, are, where is everything? <laughs> Another four floors. This doesn't feel very lucky. There we go. Ah. Uh. Okay, hold on. Oh. <laughs> that was close. I needed more iron, so why not? Ugh. Um, I think we'll be okay because it's just slimes. Okay, that bats, but I have to go anyway. See ya! <laughs> no dice. Okay, uh, what do I need more of? Yep, iron. Always iron. It's probably the most used bar. I don't need that much coffee. Okay, so that's another week gone. 
before I start next week, I just need to take a little intermission. I just need to stretch my legs, go to the bathroom, and I'm going to get more water for myself. So, just give me a couple minutes. As for the video on YouTube, this is what... I'm just going to split it here, so it'll end here. <laughs> Thanks for watching if you're on YouTube. Don't forget to do all the stuff. Okay, bye.